Hey, what's up, everybody? Real quick video here as I got to get going. A couple of years ago, I did a video talking about Celadon, how they're going to be closing. And sure enough, you know, they were. And we warned you guys. And, you know, people are in the comments and they're saying, oh, it's never going to happen, never going to happen. And guess what? It's happening. Okay. It may not happen, you know, as fast as what we had predicted, but it eventually did happen as we predicted. And so. So you guys uh, understand that uh, there's probably going to be some Celadon drivers out there who may be stranded. Uh, you guys don't know what I'm talking about. They just filed for bankruptcy and and they are ceasing operations uh, on December 9th, on Monday. Um, the link in the description I have is to Transportation Nation Network. That's the source uh, of this and uh you can read the article yourself they're reporting that uh as of right now the drivers have their fuel cards still turned on but uh after december 9th who knows so hopefully if you're a celadon driver out there um watching this hopefully you guys uh prepare for what's about to happen you know so but if you're not a celadon driver and you see a celadon driver out there um, you know, help him out if he needs it, he or she needs it, um, whether it be a ride somewhere, you know, or help him with a rental car, because this can get expensive. Uh, those of you guys have been around when the, uh, Aero truck lines, I believe it was called truck lines or Aero, they closed down a little over 10 years ago. Okay. Over a little over 10 years ago when they left their driver stranded, there's drivers at their, you know, truck stops with, no way to get home, no way to get food and all that kind of stuff. And they couldn't move. They were stranded. They were literally stranded. Um, let's make sure that don't happen again this time. Hopefully Celadon will take care of the drivers. But if not, the drivers need to take care of the drivers. So, uh, but anyways, again, Celadon um, is in the process of closing down. The link I have, I'll put in the description and the comments here. Um so go check out Transportation Nation Network. Um, I just read it while I was here at the store. So anyways, guys, um, keep those guys in your thoughts, the drivers, um, and obviously the office staff. Those are the people who get lost in a lot of this too, but they get to go home. Drivers are going to get stuck. So uh, hopefully Celadon will do the right thing and uh, you know try to make it to where these drivers get home. But they've got a lot of... A lot of a uh, lot of trucks. Was it 1,800 trucks? 1,800 drivers. I think the article said 30,000 employees or 3,000 employees. 30,000 seems kind of much, but it is a uh, it's it's a big big carrier. We all know Celadon's everywhere, and um, it is what it is. I'm sure other trucking channels will probably cover this at detail, but uh, this is uh, pretty fresh. So, well, aren't you guys later? You guys have a good Saturday, Sunday, whenever you're watching this. Remember, keep an eye out for Celadon drivers if they need help out there for sure. Celadon drivers, man, have you a plan B, whatever it is. So, uh, and if I can help in any kind of way, just holler at me. Uh, I have the link to my email in this, you know, in the description here. If there is anything I could do, I'm a local driver, but if there's anything I could do, uh, just let me know. Talk to you guys later, 73.